Welcome back savages to another video. In this video I'm going to show you how to fit a small cooling fan like this to your ESP32 S3 display. Sometimes you can find that it gets quite hot when it's in use especially if you're using for something like solo Bitcoin mining. So what we're going to do is just fit this cooling fan just to the end here and I'm using a Lilygo case so I'm just going to show you how to fit it to there. First thing you need to know is the pinouts. So on this fan you've got a positive and a negative so it's going to go in positive on the left hand side, negative on the right hand side. And what you need to do is connect it to the two outer pins just there. So what you're doing there is basically connecting it to the two outer ones on the left hand side here. Positive is going to be on the outside, negative is on the inside. And it's running off three volts right there, that fan. So what we're going to do is run it along here. And the plan is, is to just have it on the end right there. So what I've done here, this is the back ventilation part. And what I've done is I've just cut this notch out here and just made it big enough so we can feed the wire through there. So once you've cut that notch out, the cable from the mini fan should fit through there without any problems. So there we go. All done. Mini fan is now installed and it looks like this. Just using one screw to go through one of the ventilation holes right there to hold it in place. So the moment of truth, let's plug it in and see if it works. So there we go, the USB cable is now plugged in. The mine has started up and the fan is definitely working. I don't know if you can spot it there on the video, but it's definitely working. So one last thing I'd like to do is to give you the power consumption readings. So we've got the Nerdbinder V2 loaded up and running, as you can see there. We've got the mini cooling fan connected. And if we come up to this USB meter, you can see that it's using 4.8 volts and 0.2 amps and that is how you install a cooling fan on one of these Lilygo USB cases for ESP32 S3. If you have any questions please ask them in the comments below otherwise thanks for watching and I'll see you savages on the next one.